Um, what's what's wrong with Governor Hickenlooper for one, when you're talking to voters about turning away? He uh, he gets a certain amount of credit of uh, status and and credibility as a businessman who's come in and tried to bring you know, yeah. business sensibility to government. What, what are you telling? Well, I, I know that he considers himself, or at least he claimed to be a moderate when he ran. Um, but he claimed a lot of things. He claimed to be uh, supportive of gun. Uh, even after the Aurora shooting, you know, he was. Uh, he said, uh, "Well, we can't blame this on guns." Um, he claimed uh, to be supportive of the death penalty. He claimed all kinds of things that he simply wasn't. He claimed that you know he would be uh, a, a moderate leader. Well, of course, he has a state legislature that is just as ultra left wing as any, but any that I think exists in the country. And he signed every single one of the 461 bills they sent him. And, the, and a lot of those were, I think, certainly expressions of anything but moderation. Uh, you know, whether it's mandating a fourth grade sexual ori sexually oriented curriculum uh, to the, uh, the gun bills that he signed. You know, he, he said something that was really amazing. He told a group of people up in uh, Grand Junction. And, and this is perhaps the biggest problem I have with the, the governor. He is not a leader. He is not a leader. He told a group of people who were complaining to him about the um, uh, fact that there was uh, Oh, I'm sorry, he, I remember. He, he was com they were complaining to him about the gun bills, and they said, what happened? Did you, why did you sign those gun bills? Did you think that those gun bills will actually do something significant? And he, and he said, well, probably not. And then they said, well, what, why did you sign them? And he said, I sign a lot of stupid bills. Oh, my. Yeah. Well, and then the next day, or, or maybe it was the day after, it was shortly thereafter, he was on the same stage with Obama touting, because Obama had come here, to tout the gun bills. How did, the quote that he said, was this in Grand Junction? Yeah, Grand Junction. How do you know he said it? Well, there were a whole group of people you there. there. No, but I was been, not there. It has been related to you. It has been related, related to me, to yes. Okay. And so what we did was we, we tried to find as many people who were there to attest to it before I ever said that he said it.